Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Good day and welcome back to the Valder BB Show as I entertain my next guest. And that's Stacy Billis. She is a veteran food editor, an on-air personality, and she's co-host of the popular food podcast for parents, Didn't I Just Feed You? She's here to talk about a healthy diet is fundamental for a fit and happy pooch. Stacy, welcome to the Valder BB Show. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited to be here today. Well, lots of people in my audience are dog lovers. Um, I'm a dog lover vicariously. My daughter has a dog and we take care, I take care of the dog. So people have a real, real relationship with their dog. So for many of us, our dogs have helped us get past through the, you know, through that last 18 months. But you know, as a dog lover and a cookbook author, do you have some recommendations for how pet owners can you know, return the favor and give a little extra love? Absolutely. I mean, you hit the nail on the head. Our pets have really helped us through a rough time. I know that I can say that for myself. I have a dog named Ziggy who has been such a great companion over the last 18 months. And so I am thrilled to be partnering with Fruitables so that I can treat him right and return the love just like you said. So... As a cookbook author and a family food expert, my number one recommendation is always to treat them. Everybody loves treats, humans and pets alike. So I have a family, I have two boys, a 14 year old and an 11 year old. And I know that whenever you serve up treats, you want it to hit all your senses. You want it to smell good, you want it to taste good. But as a mom, I also want to make sure that there are nutrient-dense ingredients in there that can nourish them. And as a dog mom, I feel exactly the same way about how I treat Ziggy. What are some of the superfoods that can help our dogs? We work on superfoods for our family. There's got to be some for dogs. Oh, absolutely. There's a lot of alignment, actually, between superfoods for humans and for dogs. But Perfect for the season. Today, I want to talk about pumpkin. Pumpkin is so delicious and healthy. It's versatile. It's an ingredient I love working with as a recipe developer. And actually, the health benefits of pumpkin are what inspired the Fruitables line of pet treats. That's why it's a major ingredient in almost all of their treats. In fact, in 18 of them, pumpkin is the number one ingredient. And Fruitables combines that with other fruits and vegetables like apples and blueberries and strawberries, peanut butter, banana. The flavor combinations are delicious. You know, uh, I've seen dog foods come a very, very long way. And now people are concerned about what their dog eat. They don't want all those fillers and all those not good things in there. So how do we know what's the most important things to feed our dogs? Well, that's what I love about Fruitables. I mean, this is made with just wholesome ingredients. When you open the package, it actually smells good to me. (laughs) It smells delicious. (laughs) Ziggy loves them. That's important too. But it's really about those superfoods that really power Fruitables and their pet treats. So pumpkin, again, we've got apple and blueberries. The flavor combinations are so delicious sounding that I actually was inspired to develop three recipes for humans. So based on their bacon apple skinny minis, I made a recipe for bacon wrapped apple slices, which are a great after school treat. They have a line called PB and Joy that uses peanut butter, which is high in protein. And I'm always looking for high in protein recipes for my boys. So I made peanut butter banana breakfast bars, which are great for a grab and go breakfast. And back to that superfood pumpkin that we love so much. I made these pumpkin spice loft house style cookies with a Greek yogurt frosting. 
You can find your way to all of these recipes and learn more about Fruitables and where you can find them near you at fruitablespet.com slash blog. Stacy Billis, your veteran food amateur and probably most popular among the pets. Thank you for being <laughs> my guest on the Valder BB Show. Thank you so much for having me. It was good to talk to you today. Hi, I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB Show broadcast on radio and television. And this is my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands free, pocket free, purse free, even belt free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.